Hello and welcome back to another video. Today I'll be teaching you guys how to build well this typewriter in Minecraft. Um yeah, so yeah, this is just a texture pack I'm using. It's um pretty cool, pretty cool. So I'll be showing you guys how to make this. It's actually pretty easy if you understand. Um, well, it, it's mostly, yeah, that's the texture pack for the redstone, but, um, yeah, so it uses binary, and it's, it's like, it's easy if you understand this part I won't do, that's, that's later, maybe, last part, uh, I won't do everything, cause this is only the first part. I think I'll just start to explain and go all the way to J. It's, it's pretty simple to be honest. I think there's only going to be like four parts to this. And this is probably going to be the longest part. Like seriously, it must... Like it's... The entire back, the display everywhere here. It's all just uh... It's all just um... The exact same thing. Because each display segment is just the exact same. And the only thing that's pretty challenging is um, coding on the purple line for um, all the letters. That's that's really just the most difficult part. Other than that, everything is pretty simple. Um, you don't have to do like what I do for the for the structure. To be uh, for the not for structure, uh, for storage. But um, yeah, just. Just, just do what I do, really, like, it's easier if you just follow this tutorial. But I'd also encourage, if you're good at redstone, over here where all these redstone torches, to do your own customization. And, like, because I added, like, a smiley face emoji as an extra thing. You guys can also do that. You guys can do it for anything. Um, as you guys can see... There's this blue line, which is for the keyboard, for writing, stuff like that. There's the purple line, which basically where all the storage is. And this part is really important, because it stores all the things for, um, for, um, the data, basically. Like, without this, there would be no, like, letters appearing. So, yeah, it's really, really important. Let me just do an example. Yeah, so you see, thing like turns on, uh, the, the torches were activated, um, and yeah, this, so, yeah, let's get on with the tutorial, shall we? So, let's take out our purple wool, I'm just gonna keep purple wool because that's how I did my storage. If I were you guys, I do like every build do the exact same wall. So for another build, you're gonna build a storage unit or something. Just keep it with purple, or like whatever color you're using. Like I, it's it's much easier. Well, that that's just how I do. You guys don't have to do it. So I'm just gonna show you guys how to quickly make um the storage unit. So this blue line over here, you guys can see, that's just the keyboard entry. It can be like. Anyway, like it doesn't it doesn't really matter like the blue lines can twist they can go over each other Which is just the mess blue lines that I have over there. I'm not gonna be doing a tutorial on that because um Well, that's kind of useless because like You guys can just like make the blue lines go above each other If you guys really want a tutorial for that. I guess I'll, I'll do that but yeah So this is the blue line for um, going to the storage unit, and this is where the actual storage unit is. So you gotta do like a line pointing into a block with a redstone torch. And um, it has to be like, there has to be like a two block gap between that and like the floor. Well, not like the floor, but like, yeah, so it has to be two block out where the first line on the bottom floor. There are two lines of purple lines, like two levels. There's the top one and the bottom one. 
And, um, so the bottom one has to be start two things away from the end of the blue line. That's important. Okay, so this has to go on, um, 15. You have to do 15 of these lines on the bottom floor, so 15. This is important. 15, okay. You guys have to follow everything I do for the storage. Well, you guys can add stuff, but for now, just follow exactly what I do. Well, not exactly. So we gotta do 15 of these lines. Um, yeah, just quickly do 15. I'm, I'm not gonna do that, but you guys just do 15, okay? And then these lines have to go all the way to the end of those 15 lines. Pretend, pretend it goes all the way to the end of the 15 lines. Um, also, at the lines above, that's how much symbols there have to be. So if you want to do the entire alphabet, on the second layer of redstone lines, where I'm putting redstone right now, over there you have to put 26, because that's how much there are in the alphabet, or more if you want to do custom. So as you guys can see here, at one point, the redstone just signal stops. And that's a problem, right? So we have to put a repeater. Except we have to put the repeater where where there is no block, no line underneath. Oh, my game crashed. Okay, well there's gonna be a little short 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 stop for the tutorial. Um, well, yeah, so the repeater can't be, um, can't be, like, underneath, well, it can't be above where there's a line. It has to be above where there's just, like, a gap, okay? That, that's important. So it has to go right here. And, yeah, then it just continues all the way to, like, 15. Yep. So, yeah, just continue this for all the 26 lines, plus extra. If you want to do extra symbols, like a smiley face, or a, a full stop, or an exclamation mark. B basically anything, really. There's just going to be the long redstone, blah, blah, blah. Just... Yeah, this this yeah, this part should be like easy. And yeah, that's pretty much just the basic idea of the structure. But yeah, that's pretty much the basic idea. Um okay, so I rebuilt um the uh the the entire mem uh, storage, storage. I can't remember the name. Yep, so this is the mess of blue lines. You can overlap each other, creating like a keyboard that's customized or your own. It doesn't really matter. Is this around what you should have? Um, all, all those red lines, those are just connecting up redstone. That you, I don't need a tutorial for that, like, I'm pretty sure you guys can do lines connecting redstone to redstone. Um, this redstone dust that's above that purple wall, just for fun fact, that's the last redstone, um, uh, redstone dust that was placed for the machine to be completed. So, yeah, that's like the last redstone dust I put. It was on a connecting thing, cause the, I did the connecting thing last, but anyway, this is what you guys should have, um, Above 16 and underneath 15. There should be comparators underneath and above. Just to remind you, comparators on the top layer underneath, there has to be no line. But for the comparators at the bottom line, there has to be a block above, okay? Like, that is important. So on the bottom layer, there has to be a block above. On the top layer, there has to be no block under. See, see over here? It has to be like that, okay? If you guys don't do it, if you guys don't do it well, um, then it won't work. Like, yeah, it won't work. There'll be a part of your display that just, just won't work. 
So now we gotta actually give put information into the storage about each neural. So you guys can do like the A and any thing so in A. So because there are uh, 50 bottom things, there has to be redstone torch right starting at the bottom line. One, two, three gaps. One redstone torch, gap, one redstone torch, gap, 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 one redstone torch, 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 gap, 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 one redstone torch, Gap, one redstone torch, gap, one redstone torch, gap, one redstone torch. That is all the information for A. Yeah, it's it's long. That that's why that's why this tutorial is gonna be in many parts because it's mostly about the storage unit. Um so now B. So remember the first redstone torch or the first gap it has to start right above the first line that is closest, which should be two blocks away from the redstone torch at the that's connect. So one redstone torch gap, one redstone torch gap, one redstone torch gap, one redstone torch gap, 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 one redstone torch gap, one redstone torch gap, one redstone torch gap, one redstone torch gap, one redstone torch. Gap, 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 one redstone torch, gap, one redstone torch, gap, one redstone torch, gap, gap. And that's everything for B. Okay. Now we gotta do for C. Oh, I destroyed something there. Yeah, as you guys can see, uh, I loaded structure. Okay, I admit it. The, the structure that I built just before. Yeah, I, 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 I didn't, I just copy pasted and like, I, I couldn't be bothered. It just, it just takes a lot of time. But that, that's what you guys are gonna do, have to do. Normally, if you guys are watching this, you guys should have already done that. But yeah, I always just save up a structure and just copy paste. So it goes much faster. But yeah, that's a faster way to build a structure. But for resin torch, you have to do that separately. So now for C, where's C, 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 I don't know why I did it in this formation, I don't, I don't know where anything is, C, okay, so C, so this is the code for C, um, so it starts at the first line, redstone torch, gap, redstone torch, gap, redstone torch, gap, redstone torch, gap, 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 redstone torch, gap, 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 gap. Redstone torch, gap, 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 gap. Redstone torch, gap, redstone torch, gap, redstone torch. You guys might be wondering why I put this texture back. Because it's much easier to see with the wool. Because like, it has like an outline, stuff like that. And yeah, it's it's easier to do, it's easier to see really. I don't know why my voice is delaying. I, I just, I don't know why. So my voice seems to be delaying. I don't know why, so don't really listen to my voice. Just just look mostly look at the thing. Yeah, just just watch watch at my hand. I, I have no idea why. But for some reason for all my videos my voice like the recording just always delays. Like it's like as if it records the delay and then adds like a few like milliseconds or something. In between every time we talk so it adds longer anyway just really just follow this tutorial at this part very closely with great attention because like really this part is extremely important um so this is a voiceover if you guys didn't realize cuz yeah so um, I'm planning to do maybe after I finish this series of tutorial. Um, I don't really know what to do. I tried building a Spotify thing with music, but 
I, I'm terrible at no block stuff. Like seriously, I'm just utterly terrible. So I only did like a few tunes. I did a Tetris tune. I did all the music discs. And I also did a beat. And that's all I did for a, a Barbify, I think I call it. But um, yeah, I want maybe I want to do next like mini games, like Hangman maybe. Do you guys think Hangman will be good? Or maybe um, I tried, yeah, I tried doing Flappy Bird a bit, but I I could manage to do um for the red coder. If uh, you guys probably won't understand what I'm saying, but you need to do a red coder and it needs to add. So it does like the moving effect, like the jumping effect for the flap bird. Except every time when you do jump, it brings you automatically to the top screen and not like a few pixel higher. I don't know if I just like just don't know how to do it. Or is that it just doesn't work with Bedrock. Because with Bedrock we got a pretty new uh, redstone update. Which me, which makes the old version of XOR gates completely useless. You guys probably don't even know what an XOR gate is. Don't worry, but um, it's pretty use. It's really useful. Like it's literally impossible to do without for um calculators. But I made another type of XOR gate for bedrock that works if you guys want me if anyone wants to know what it is just like comment it and i will i will just share it like i will just like post it on the community thing yeah i realize i have a community thing now where i can like do polls like that is so cool i don't know if it's just a glitch because i received a notification from youtube telling me i could do that when normally you can only do that at 500 subs so, and I've been getting, like, a lot of, like, these things that you're supposed to get after. Like, for some extremely bizarre reason, it says I can't do lives, but I can, which is extremely weird. But, yeah, you guys probably, yeah, I'm just... My voice is delayed, kind of useless. That I'm telling you, guys, redstone torch, like redstone torch, gap, like it, it's it's useless. Cause like, yeah, cause like it's just it's useless, really. But mm, yeah, so I'm gonna do polls, maybe as checking what I should do next. As um and yeah, I'll release a tutorial. By the way, check out my latest video, which is the um, building cat bank, which was inspired by Mumbo Jumbo, where it's just like that toy, you know, where you put a coin on like a little button and then the box opens and like a cat paw comes out. It takes the coin and it's like a mini safe. Uh, yeah, that's that's basically what it is. Um, I did a compact version of it and I'll release a tutorial for that at 10 likes. Um, but this, this series, I'm not gonna do like, oh yeah, yeah, 10 likes for part 2, I'm, I'm gonna do a part 2, I'll probably, this, I'll probably do like 4 parts, this, I, I think, that's how long it's gonna take to do this computer, cause like, um, I'm not gonna do any of the red circuits, as I said before, which is just connecting stuff, I'm pretty sure you guys can do that, I'll just probably label each place where you have to connect it with a block in the tutorial, and like a diamond block, okay, you see these two diamond block plates, you gotta find out a way to put them together. I'll probably just do that, because um, that's probably the easiest way to do it. But, um, so, yeah, uh, as I said before, I'll post on polls. Please just um, try, and um, yeah, see you guys for part two of this tutorial. Um, yeah. Bye.